Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Today I'm back with another Turkish lesson. I've always believed that in order to learn a language, you have to master the pronouns. And for some languages, it holds more true than the rest of them. And Turkish happens to be just one of those languages in which you have to, you must master the pronouns. And it is so much dependent the structure of Turkish language is so much dependent on pronouns that once you have mastered it the rest would become so easy it would just be um, a thing you can just build up on your knowledge of the pronouns so today I'm going to give you this lesson and you must you must memorize this table the whole of it the sooner you do it the better because there are so many other practice tables that will be following this. So I'm going to repeat all these words um, once or twice and then you can repeat the video and you can learn them. And trust me, so far I have not come across any language teaching website or um, video that focuses on grammar. People make videos and they start teaching you sentences or they start teaching you vocabulary which is not even relevant when it comes to, to learning a language. When you start learning a language, you must, must focus on the grammar because that is the basic, basic pillars that hold the whole architecture of the language. So once you master the grammar, once you've mastered the that portion of the grammar that is crucial to that particular language then everything becomes easier so pronouns in Turkish language make 90% of the whole effort that you will be making in learning this language that's how to mold how to um, alter the following words and the whole sentence if you can say uh, in accordance with which pronoun you are using yes that's how it is every verb will change according to its pronoun so now I'm gonna start I'm gonna repeat this and then you can repeat and learn this table uh, doesn't matter if you take a month, doesn't matter if you take two months, but you must memorize this table. So here it is. First I'm going to do the singular table. Kim is a question. It means who. So we're going to learn Kim, Ben, Sen, O. Kime, Bana, Sana, Ona. Kimde, Banda, Sende, Onda. Kimden, Benden, Senden, Ondan. Kimi, Beni, Seni, Onu. Kimin, Benim, Senin, Onun. And the plural chart. Kim, Biz, Siz, Onlar. Kime, Bize, Size, Onlara. Kimde, Bizde, sizde, onlarda. Kimden, bizden, sizden, onlardan. Kimi, bizi, sizi, onları. Kimin, bizim, sizin, onların. Kim, ben, sen, o. Kime, bana, sana, ona. Kimde, bende, sende, onda. Kimden, benden, senden, ondan. Kimi, beni, seni, onu. Kimin, benim, senin, onun. Kim, biz, siz, onlar. Kime, bize, size, onlara. Kimde, bizde, sizde, onlarda. Kimden, bizden, sizden, onlardan. Kimi, bizi, sizi, onları. Kimin, Bizim sizin onların.
these are the two tables that you have to memorize and keep repeating till you know them as your own name you must learn these if you want to learn the Turkish language once again I would like to emphasize that these are very very important they are very crucial and you have to memorize these before you start your journey of learning the Turkish language so keep repeating them and I will be coming back with another class until then take good care of yourselves bye